people should not take away from my experience uh, that testing is not reliable or it doesn't work. Uh, what I took was, as you pointed out, an antigen test, which is really a, should be looked at as a screening test. Mm -hmm. uh, 1.3 million Ohioans have taken a PCR test. Uh, that test is very, very, very reliable. And, and so that is the diagnostic test. That's the test that we've been using uh, in Ohio. The antigen tests are fairly new, and the companies that are coming out with them, quite frankly, have the burden of showing, uh, you know, how, how good they are. Could they be used in, in some situation? Yeah, they could be, but you have to understand going in that you can get the false positives, uh, it, like happened in my case, or you can get the false negative. So, so you're still going ahead with this plan way. with the other governors? Yeah, all, we, all we've done is we've said, let's group together. Uh, let's put our purchasing power together, mm -hmm. uh, not just potentially for antigen tests, but maybe for other things as well. So we're taking this one step at a time. What we, what we saw the other day is, is certainly, uh, if anyone needed a wake-up call uh, with uh, about antigens, uh, how careful you have to be, that was, we certainly saw that with my test. And we're going to be very careful in how, in how we use it.